Hello friends, I'm Parwiz and this is our uh, 45th video in PyQt5 GUI programming. Uh, in the last video we have uh, covered about uh, uh, conical gradient in PyQt5 uh, and also uh, we had uh, three separate videos for three kind of uh, gradients uh, for uh, linear gradients, uh, the radial gradients and conical gradients. Uh, in this video, we are going to cover about uh, a little advanced topics about uh, uh, PyQt5, QGraphic scene, and also QGraphic view. Uh, let me show you that uh, what we are going to make in this video. Uh, let me run this. Uh, this is the uh, sample that uh, we are going to make. We have a, <coughs> a graphic view, and also we have a two uh, a rectangle, and also a uh, an ellipse. Uh, now I can. You can see that um, I can move these uh, uh, ellipse and rectangle. Um, you can see that I can move it in every rear mm, like this uh, in a graphic scene. Okay. Uh, in this video, we are going to make uh, like this. Uh, I have made a new uh, Python file in here at name of QGraphic View. Uh, and also I'm going to copy my window code from the previous videos and paste it in here. Uh, let me change the title to PyQt5 uh, Q Graphic View like this. Uh, let me run this. You can see now I have a window. Okay. Uh, now the first thing I need uh, in the in def init in here. Uh, okay, uh, the first thing you need you should import uh, Q graphic view and Q graphic scene. In here, we need a Q graphic scene. Also, we need a Q graphic view. Okay. Uh, now in here, <coughs> make a scene. Q graphic scene like this, and also I need a. Uh, Brush in here uh, from pyqt5 dot qt GUI import q brush and uh, also from pyqt5 dot qt core import qt like this. Okay. Uh, now I'm going to make uh, two brushes in here. Uh, the first one is uh, red brush, Q brush, QT dot red. Also, I need a blue brush, uh, blue brush, Q brush, QT dot blue. Sorry, dot blue. Okay. Now the another import that we need. Uh, let me add this. We need a Q pen also. And in here, I make a pen, a black pen, Q pen, uh, QT dot black. Sorry, not blue. Uh, black. Okay. Also set the width. To your pen dot set width, I give it seven. Okay. Uh, now I'm going to uh, okay. Uh, now this was our uh, pen. Up after that, I'm going to uh, make a view, a Q graphic view, Q graphic view. And give your scene in here and also self. Also set the geometry for your graphic view. Um, I give it 0, 0 and uh, 680 and 500. Uh, let me run this. Yeah, uh, you can see now we have a scene also, we have a graphic view. Uh, now, uh, for example, uh, if you want to add an ellipse in here, uh, in this section we are going to add an ellipse. You can simply write ellipse 
we are going to add ellipse to our scene scene dot add ellipse we can now give 10 10 all oh, oh, sorry not 100 10 by 10 and 200 by 200 uh, we give the black pen also we give the red brush okay uh, let me run this you can see now we have a nice ellipse red color ellipse after this I'm going to draw a rect scene dot uh, add rect I give it minus hundred uh, minus hundred the size should be 200 and 200 now give the black pen and the blue brush let me run this uh, now you can see we have a rectangle in here uh, right now we cannot move this uh, but if you want to make make these uh, objects movable uh, these rectangles movable uh, we have uh, some flags uh, you can use from the flags uh, for this okay for example if you want to uh, make move movable the lips you can simply write lips dot set dot set flag and also we need a cube graphic item you should import a a Q graphic item in here yeah this is Q graphic item okay now set flag Q graphic item dot item dot item is movable simple uh, you can just by one line of code you can move your uh, uh, drawing uh, for now you can see I can move the uh, ellipse but I cannot move the rectangle uh, for this you can set the flag for this simply write rect uh, dot set flag q graphic item dot item is movable now if I run this you can see now I can run my bot uh, uh, drawing like this. Okay, uh, so cool stuff and powerful stuff just by two line of code you can do this. Uh, like this. Okay. Uh, thank you guys. If you have any question, please let me know and. For the further videos, uh, don't forget subscription of uh, my channel.